Heck yeah. All right, hold on, buddy. Hold on. There he is. There he is. Woo. How you doing, buddy? You doing all right? No? Making Bone Gang, and welcome back to another episode. Today, I'm on the water. Finally, on the water again. First time since the storm. It's been a month and a couple days since Hurricane Ida hit, and I was just uh, tired of playing in the mud. Needed a break. Wanted to film a fishing video, finally, once again, to see how uh, everything looked after the storm. So I'm hitting my usual spots just to see what everything looks like, see if the fishing changed, because a month ago before the storm hit, uh, we was slamming them on top water. And I was kind of thinking things are going to change uh, once I got out here. I'm looking at the water temperature of 77, so that dropped tremendously, probably from all the rain, water getting stirred up, and we had a mild cool front roll through. So, But I pulled up to my first spot, and uh, I'm seeing Chad and something chasing him. So it's looking good already. But the first thing I notice about the, the landscape change is you can see these trees behind me have thinned out tremendously from the storm. And on the way in, in this bayou, they had a uh, lot of flotons everywhere. Little chunks of islands floating around. I even had to meander through one that was pretty much blocking the whole thing. They had a little path going through and, and, and whatnot. All right, I can't watch these fish chase the shad anymore. I'm gonna uh, rig up the old fishing poles and get after it. Oh, right. Oh my goodness. It feels so good to be back out on the water. Coffee always seems to taste better out here too. All right. Well, this is my first cast with this brand new Luz Mach Pro rod and reel combo. I uh, had to get some couple new rod and reels because I lost all of mine in the storm. They were in my shed, got covered in salt water and mud for over a month. And I pulled them out, tried to turn the crank. It wouldn't turn. I had some points at Cabela's. Oh my goodness. That thing casts like a dream. Jeez, um. Had some points at Cabela's. That's the only reason I bought such a fancy, expensive rod and real combo. But, you know, when you don't know what insurance money is going to give you, you got to be conservative. So I got this one and I went to Academy and got that Max X Abu Garcia combo. Because I used to have a Black Max and that's just basically the updated version of it. So now I'm rocking the, the two fishing pole game instead of the four like I usually use. But that's all right. We'll get some more. Take a little time. We'll get it. We're gonna get it. Hopefully we can get a fish. And nothing. Oh my goodness, that's why you pay that much for a rod and reel. Jeez, um, that thing casts so pretty. And nothing. Well, the first spot didn't exactly work out like I thought it would. Saw the shad jumping. I don't know what was after the shad. Because I don't think it was bass. Or we might have caught one. But I'm to the spot where uh this time of year redfish start to try and move in and that's different if you can see that pond behind me all of that should be filled in and there should be trees up to at least the point where you see this little tree sticking up right there and uh well i guess most of the marsh as you can see all of this probably came from there and all this marsh right here ain't supposed to be there either there's like a, a rock wall that comes up through here but uh i can't even see the rock wall so i'm sure these flotons are making a new home, I guess, but they're probably gonna go to and fro with the tides until uh, I guess they find a home, you know? So, oh, let's go see if we can't catch some redfish. I got me a fish. <laughs> oh, it's a redfish. Heck yeah. All right, hold on, buddy. Hold on, buddy, I wasn't paying attention. I didn't have the cameras going on or nothing. Paying attention to an alligator. Oh, you might be a keeper too. Might be a keeper too, ball. Uh, I think I got a thing somewhere. Let me see. I'm just straight slipping and tripping, man. I'm sitting here looking at all this because all this is different. That used to be a little rock wall. Well, there's a rock wall in there somewhere. It's probably that little high ridge right there, right before the trees. But uh, anyway, we got. Oh, I bet you that was another. Oh, dude. All right, we gotta stop. Uh, we gotta stop messing around, you know. Let me get this guy. Measuring, boy. Come see, partner. Let's see how big. All right. Can you sell them? Can Can you sell them? I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you out. You just gotta give me a second. Let me see if I can find my grabbers. I got no pair of grabbers right there. 
That'll help me. That'll help me hold on, dude. Come on, Brian. Chill out. Spooky little guy, ain't you? There we go. All right, bro. Here you go around. You got yourself all tangled up. There you go. Ooh, my dude got two spots on each side. Check that out. Handsome little devil. Oh, I guarantee he's gonna make it. Oh me, yeah, 19 inches. We can do that all day. Gotta put that on the gram, cause that's exciting. I ain't caught a fish since before the storm. Ain't caught a redfish in quite a while. In mid, that's what I like to catch, yeah. I do enjoy catching bass, but man, ain't nothing like a good old redfish. By the way, if you wanna keep up with my day-to-day -day activities, you can always follow me on Instagram. I try and keep up with the stories every day, making posts every now and then. We definitely keeping fish today, folks, cause uh, I done lost everything in my freezer when my power went out for the storm, so. I need some fish meat. You dig? Alright. <laughs> That's got me excited. Got me a little excited there, fool. Woo! Heck yeah. Oh, 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 we just missed one. We just missed one. Let's see if he... I don't know if he felt the hook, so let's try him again. Come on. Maybe not. Maybe we're just hitting the bottom and I'm getting too excited. All right, one more cast. Oh, that was, oh, there was no doubt that was a bite. Why is he missing it? I tell you what, let's throw this rattle trap and see what happens. That was a bite. That sucker pulled back and I wasn't even reeling. Come here, big dog. Why you keep missing that? There he is. There he is. Woo! 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 I knew I kept feeling a bite. Woo! Come on, big daddy. Only got 20 pound on this one. I gotta ease him in. I don't wanna. Ooh. Come on, big dog. Oh, yeah, you're so pretty. You're so pretty. Come on, big daddy. Should I flip him? I'm kinda scared to flip him, but yep. Yeah. Heck yeah. Ooh, that must have been your old boy's cause, eh? This dude got three spots on each side. Oh my goodness, look how pretty. That gold is beautiful. <laughs> All right, bro. All right, my brother. Calm down, brother. Let's get this in here. Ow, okay, okay. I know you mad. I know you mad. I don't blame you. I get it. I wouldn't like it either. Oh. Well, well, Guggen Squad, you need to come up with some better uh, grabbers there, partner. Because these ain't worth a bad gun. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Let me get a pair of pliers for my. I'll stick myself. Uh, we don't need this trip turning south that quick. Oh no, my brand new fishing pole. What the heck? Oh my goodness. Let me apply them. There we go. I know you're big enough, but we're gonna measure you anyway. Oh yeah. She. You about a half inch bigger than your cousin. That is nice. Look at that. Three spots on each side. That's two. Two in the box. Question is, which one do we want to cast? Do we want to keep casting this little rattle trap or that underspin? Because we caught one on boat. Uh oh, here come a boat. Y'all be cool. Y'all be cool. Act like you're not catching nothing. There we go. Running right across this thing. Mm, no. It's amazing how different all of this looks because normally i'd be fishing just a rock wall and all of this floats on would be well in the marsh where it belongs definitely gonna have to get some new maps that's gonna be the spot right there right there is where we're gonna catch a fish and nothing another little pocket come on baby you gotta be up in there somewhere huh Mm, no. Just for giggles, let's toss it out towards the middle. Mm, no. Oh, oh. That is not a fish. That's not a fish. That is the ground. All right, y'all. So here's the situation. 
I've been running all over the place. I haven't caught any more fish. What I have been doing is going around looking at how different everything is. So I'm riding down this little canal right here behind me. Figure I'm gonna give it a few more tosses, cast the line, try and catch a fish. And lo and behold, I'm like, oh my God, there's a dead deer over there. And then I got to looking, I was like, man, that's awfully pretty to be a dead deer, but it's laying on its back facing up, so it can't be a live deer. But look right there. Somebody's mounted deer is out here in the marsh, so I will save you <laughs> if I don't die trying. I'm gonna take this push pull just to help me. Most of this should be hard marsh. I say hard, but you know, some healthy floton. Now, if I happen to not make it and somebody come across this video, y'all make sure y'all post it on YouTube. Send the proceeds to my wife. All right, that's not too bad. Ain't too bad. Oh, yeah. yeah, buddy. How you doing, buddy? You doing all right? No? You don't look like you're doing too good at all. Let's see what we can do with you. Oh, yeah, buddy. Let's see. Oh, you caught in all the grass, dude. Ken LeBlanc. I wonder if Ken wants his deer back. Oof. Well, Ken, I don't know. You don't look too good. Looking a little rough. You're looking a little rough there. What the heck? We're going to take him back. I'm going to wash him off and see what we can do. I don't know a Ken LeBlanc, but maybe we'll post it on Facebook, see if he wants it. Who knows? It might have meant a lot to him. So I guess we're going to post that on Facebook and see. Dang, I just threw that on my brand new fishing pole. Now, how am I going to get back in this boat? Let's see, hopefully this don't sink. Okay, Woo. Thought that was gonna be it. All right. All right there, buddy. You hang tight, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna start heading on back. Well, fast forward about two, three, four, five days later, not really sure, uh, but I was editing in this video last night and realized I didn't do an outro, so, well, here it is. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. It was nice to get out and finally do some fishing after uh, over a month. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. If you did, make sure you hit the thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, all that good stuff. Yes, I'm about to go try and pump all this water out of my backyard, but uh, you'll see that in an upcoming video. So until next time, guys, have a good one, and I'll catch you on the next one.